good morning guys so today is the 26th of july 2024 the olympics officially started today yippee and don't mind some vandals i read in sky news that some vandals are trying to sabotage the olympics and starting fire in, in the train routes or something in paris you know paris has been under it's just been under consistent security alert for months and they're always stealing from celebrities and other tourists and vloggers always bad things even when i went to paris last october for my birthday i was a little worried you know a little skeptical about going but anyway we're here uh, hopefully everything goes well and nobody is hurt during this period Please let people have a good time, guys. Please, please. So, here we are with grocery from Iceland. I'm always excited about my Iceland delivery. So, I don't know. I like when people do this um, grocery haul video. So, I'm going to find where to pop you guys and just put it in time lapse or something and add some music, I guess. Or maybe we'll do ASMR. All right. So, we'll see which one it is. Okay. Okay, guys, so I'll place you there. I think it's better. This, this, um, that's it. So you can see when I put things in the fridge. So I've already put cheese, two types of cheese, mozzarella and cheddar. The other one is uh, grated matcha cheddar. I always like to buy two types. So water, I always use bottled water. If you find this video, <laughs> sorry, I just. I just love like watching grocery hauls, so I was expecting that people might want to see how I pack my groceries. It's pretty straightforward, I guess. But what is I but I enjoy grocery hauls, so those that do, please keep watching. And while we are here, please subscribe, like, share, and comment. So I'll just try to bring you guys up to speed with what we're going to do today. Now that the video has come and gone. I'm going to go to Crown Center. One, because I told people I'm intentional about how I spend my day off work. So I don't work five days for those of you that are watching the first time. June, something happened in June of 2022. And I decided, because that was even when I had COVID. I had COVID twice, guys. What are the chances that COVID would decide that he wanted to deceive me twice? So. Um, after that experience, I just said, okay, retirement is a scam. I'm only going to work smart. I'm not going to work hard. So I decided to reduce my employment contract from 100% to 80 just because. And I said, for me, as long as I'm able to have fun and pay my bills, have a life, I don't have to work full time so that's what has happened and I've been enjoying it so far. I remember telling one of my friends about it and they said to me, Oh, what do you do on that day? I said to them, have fun. There's something called having fun. How about that? You know, I just realized that our world is so busy that nobody people don't know how to have fun anymore. And that's sad in my opinion. That's very sad. So yeah, uh, so I put in some of the tango orange can drinks and then the rest I'll just drop here. Put in some water and the rest I'll drop here as well. So that's what I do. Alright, so let's get the second bag. So you can already know milk of choice is Cravendale. I finished the other one the other day when I was making my oatmeal. So uh, this is smoothie, mango and passion fruit smoothie. One for each person. Go and watch my one of my hauls. You see the the thinking behind the arrangement of my kitchen. But when I'm done, I'll probably show you people what the fridge looks like. Okay, so we'll get to that point, and I'll show you guys what my fridge is looking like after my grocery delivery. That one. So like I said, we'll go to town centre later on. Weather is absolutely gorgeous. I'm wondering if maybe we should go for a cheeky run before we actually go to town centre. Maybe that's what we'll do. What do you guys think? Go for a run or a walk? One of those. So I still have butter. I really don't understand why I bought more. But here we are. I bought butter. Just 
put that there. And chicken wings. You guys know my kickass um, recipe, chicken wings recipe. I'm sure those of you that have been with me for a while now know that. And then people know how I eat my vanilla ice cream. By plain vanilla ice cream and then you have crunching up peanut butter. You have the biscuit spread. You can just go to town with this. You have strawberry uh, syrup, anything. So we always have this in the house or try to. But the last uh, grocery shop we went for, we got the Ben and Jerry's. They were on sale. I think it was three for 12 pounds. No, three for 10 pounds maybe. So it was good sale. And then those of you that also follow me know that this girl is addicted to ice. So I will always have ice in my house. Always. I have two now currently in the freezer. So there must be ice. Okay, and then skin on fries. So different shops have their versions of skin on fries. I actually never saw one from Iceland. Iceland has different varieties of fries, so many. But my children prefer skin on fries. Actually, the one from um, this one was expensive. Well, considering it's fries, two pounds seventy-five. The one from Lidl is usually one pound forty or so. So you could get two packets for one in Lidl, but it's fine. I mean. Little does not do delivery and I'm getting so used to home delivery so I got two packets of that I'm just hoping my freezer <laughs> would you know accommodate all the frozen foods I bought then chicken pop popsters so like a bit like chicken nuggets because my kids are always you know changing what they like southern fried chicken popcorn as well and one more stuff this southern fried another type so put that I want to go to TK Maxx, look around the shops and see, you know, what I like. So that's eggs. Lovely. Just thinking I'm going to put these eggs now. For now. And then, as time goes by, I'll take them out of the container. Foil, new foil is here. I think I'll just put it here on the microwave here. And then when the other one. So, of course, we're three people in the house. I'm currently with my two children, my son who is 18 and my daughter who is 19. So we love this stuff. So I usually would buy three of this. And then uh, we like our sweet and salty popcorn. So we've got this. It's uh, fizzy strawberries. And then this is sweet and smoky ketchup sauce. We have a couple of sauces here. I'll spin you guys around and show you. And then I saw this and I decided to buy coconut and Caribbean rum. So I'll probably have that with Coke or maybe even try it with the um, Tango Fanta that I got. But I'm sure it's rum and Coke is a more popular um, combo. So do you put rum in the fridge? I honestly don't know, guys, whether you put rum in the fridge. I'll put it in the fridge, though. And then I got coffee's crisp. Uh, Chris. You see, when you do this online delivery, they're very smart. They would let you edit it before they actually pack it. So you have up till like 11 p.m. the night before. Some will say 9 p.m. the night before to edit your cart, your grocery cart online. And so yesterday I just added this. What else did I add last night? This was just one pound. And what else did I add? And the rum. So very dangerous. So it's just, you know, you should always have wipes or different things, stains on the carpet, anywhere. Wipes everywhere, like just... You don't have to have babies to buy wipes, guys. Wipes are very crucial. So that's it. Like I said, those are the snacks. I'm trying really because, you know, I'm trying to really be careful with how I load my kids with sugar. But they're adults. I mean, they have a right to say yes or they can say no. Okay. Nobody's forcing anything down anybody's throat. And then toasty white buttons, toasty soft thick white is a bread of choice. That's what we prefer. I have one there now that is going to be thrown away because it's not our favorite. I hate to throw away food though. Wipes. And you can see those are prawn crackers at the back. My daughter ordered Chinese last night. You see the leftover, what she left for me. Because guys, yesterday I went to bed so early, I was so tired. So the freezer, you saw the things I put in there, is so full. Thank God. That's something that belongs to my son. I think he's rolling, you know, these cold rollers for the face or something. Huh? High maintenance. So of course, those are the drinks. I got a new bag of rice when we went to African shop last week. So let's go to the fridge now. Yeah, that's how I like my fridge to look. You already know the things that are inside. Like I said, leftover Chinese that she kept for me. In there is carrot cake from 
uh, a friend of mine at work remember i went into london for work yesterday and i guess that is in her plate that's hers as well so yes so like i said this side belongs to my daughter except the room of course no yeah some things there they're hers in the middle is mine and in here my son okay so everybody knows where their stuff is so yeah that's it so hope you enjoy this haul i'll pick up with you guys I'm later. currently making some macaroni uh no, no, no mac and cheese guys they're going to have it with some pasta sauce i made earlier so that's lunch for my kids so i've done my devotion by now morning devotion and that is when i set time aside each day to study the word of god and pray and really that's what i should have done before everything else that should come first once you wake up but that's that's okay god understands so my perfume of choice today is coco chanel mademoiselle and um, yeah and my hair is still holding up because i remember i have the wrap over it overnight so no makeup guys but i have sunscreen the weather is it's too hot guys it's too hot hello guys i'm out I'm going to go now and I'll finish my devotion later. Sometimes it happens like that. So I'll go back so you can see my outfit of the day. I already saw that earlier on. There we go. I missed the new train, guys. I'm so upset. I love the new train whenever I travel. Look okay. up. Okay, honestly, guys, go to charity shops because you find vintage pieces that you never find in the shops you see like plates like that i don't know if you saw the dogs in our kitchen the plates look at that those are beautiful set of plates oh my god look at those ones he's just putting up there oh my god look at those pieces you only find this in charity shops guys look at those i grew up with plates like this and now you know, i'm just finding regular plates that are just plain jeans then I'm looking for a vase. I only have one at home, or maybe three. But this is, this is so pretty. I'm not even in the mood to carry anything heavy today. It doesn't have a price on it though. Three pounds. That's really pretty. That's pretty as well. And that one inside, two pounds fifty. Told you, very unique pieces, guys. Try the charity shops. You'll be pleasantly surprised. If I should go to Primark, guys, what will I be looking for in Primark? I got a really nice top the last time I was there, so should I go today or not? Let me go to TK Maxx. Who else gets excited about shopping at TK Maxx? Raise both hands. <laughs> We're here. And I do realize that TK sells stacks now, and I'm looking for something like this to kind of have a stack. They don't have things like this all the time, guys. So whenever you see, just take it because it'll sure be reasonably priced i'm in the main section of tk max and then um, just a bit confused as to what to buy i'm thinking of buying a branded face cap for myself the sun is too much it's too hot yes guys i pulled the tree down this one it looks so nice and, um, the one I buy. i think that tk is doing the yellow label sale that's how come I got this hat for 12 pounds. Look at this. Why do I have big feet, guys? That is so pretty. This is the leather version of the one that I have. And it has that metal thing across like it's Gucci. Beauty can be hit and miss sometimes. But today they have beautiful pieces, guys. What an absolutely gorgeous dress, guys. <laughs> sure, that's one thing I don't have in my wardrobe. It's a lovely jeans jacket, guys. What's the best place to get one from? It has the same concept as um, the Gucci... What collection is this? The sea, something to do with uh, the, the... Is it the beach collection they call it? Is it Givenchy or Gucci? One of those designers have bags like this, like the totes that look like this. I can't remember. Remind me in the comments if you want. Look at it. You know, added more products, guys. This shelf didn't used to go up like this to this height. It used to just stop at this level. Now look. Oh, they have foam cleansers. Remember I told you guys, always get foam cleansers for your face. And look at the back to see if it's made in Asia. See? They always have the, the nicest skin. I'm getting this, guys. From the gym vitamin E. And the Estelada sensors or the perfume spray. I love when the train is on time. Alright. And I'm just about to do a quick TK Maxx haul. 
my mom always says it's not about the quantity it's the quality so of course i got myself a new uh, dk and y heart they were doing the yellow label sales so a lot of things were massively reduced this wasn't reduced this was the wallet that i got for my friend and then this collagen blend with vitamin e uh, the one i have is with squalene so i know that this is good and then i got myself a new perfume i've been meaning to do this and i'm really happy estee lauder sensors tell me guys if you could know about this i'll give you a review when i've opened it and used it so i decided to do a quick unboxing of this and try and test and smell test first impressions nice this is crazy the paris olympics their high speed rail lines have been sabotaged so guys i just wanted to share my lunch with you before i close out the vlog i'm going to have the chinese fried rice and uh, chips uh, with chicken that my daughter got for me last night now i'm going to try this sandy coke coconut and caribbean rum with coke coke zero uh, since we moved into this house i haven't actually used this glass and then in there i have my regular ice i'm at the yeah, i'm changed and i'm about to have lunch and just chill and watch the maybe the opening ceremony for the olympics so yes hope you guys have a good weekend and see you in the next one bye